versatile company is a certified Microsoft Project Training Partner. This tutorial is designed to give you a quick, focused tip on a key feature of Microsoft Project 2010. The Gantt view is the most popular view in Microsoft Project, but it's primarily for task scheduling, not resource scheduling. In previous versions of Project, resources had to be assigned to tasks, and then the schedule leveled to accommodate resource availability. Project 2010's new Team Planner view allows tasks to be assigned directly to resources. Access the Team Planner from the Gantt view by using the Resource tab and selecting the Team Planner view. Initially, a Team Planner view has no tasks assigned to resources. In our model, it's clear that assignments are underway, though not completed yet. Some tasks are unassigned, some are assigned but not scheduled, and others are scheduled in resource-specific calendars. To assign or schedule tasks to a resource, drag the taskbar from the unassigned task portion of the view to a resource's unscheduled task field, as we have here, or drag the task into the resources portion of the calendar to assign and schedule the task. Getting detailed information regarding any task is obtained by holding the mouse cursor over a bar and then reading the resulting information offered by the program. Double-clicking on a task will bring up Task Information dialog. This is a tabbed dialog displaying task details. Like the Timeline view, the Team Planner view can be formatted to emphasize tasks for your audience. Right-click on any bar to format that bar, applying background color, or for text formatting. The Team Planner is a powerful reporting tool for managing schedules and for tracking progress from the resource perspective. There's more to know about Microsoft Project 2010. Be sure to check out our other project tutorials on YouTube. For great training in project or project management, contact us at www.versitalcompany.com.